Anne from Dorset, thanks for your text, 07786200961. Anne has a recurring dream, Ian, where he's, where she's lost in a haze. She hears a baby crying, but she can't find it. She spins round and round, and flashes of faces and voices call out to her, taunting her and calling her names. She tried waking herself up, but can't, and the dream has caused her a lot of distress as it's affecting her everyday life. She's in her 40s, she has one child, and in a relationship, and this dream, and this is the incredible part of this text, Anne, happens to her about four times a week since last year. What do you make of that, Ian? Okay, when we dream that we're in a, in a haze, then we're in some sort of disorientation. We feel like we're not making progress, we don't know what way we want to go. So there's something that Anne's trying to decide. She's trying to make this decision about what she's going to do with the next stage of her life. And the baby crying, now it can be a couple of things. It might be the, the idea of a real baby. It's maybe that Anne would like to have another child. And that is crying out to her. So she has that feeling that she wants to have another child. Or quite often what a baby means is that there's some project or something that Anne does, some passion that she has, or some talent or skill that she's kind of ignoring just now. And that thing is something that she really, really wants to do, something she can be really creative with. So she feels a bit disoriented. She's not quite sure what she wants to do. She's trying to make that decision. And all those people around her taunting and calling her names, those people are just really reflections of herself. She's being very critical of herself and very judgmental, the fact that she can't make this decision. And it's really, really preying on her mind. That's why she's having this dream up to four times a week. So what Anne needs to do in waking life is just sit down and with her partner and with her close friends, really, really objectively think what she wants and really decide what this thing that she needs to do and just to make that decision. And once the decision's made, then the dreams will start to fade away. Okay, Anne, uh, thanks so much for the text on there. 